I'm the one who's been coming around looking loving you. You're the medicine I need to heal the way you make me feel. See, I can't actually sing. Make me feel. Oh, I just can't sing very high. <laughs> is the issue. That's why the intros to these never work out that well. I'm gonna be manicured. Why is this not turning on? I think it's finally giving up the ghost. It is me, small pop star Lady Gaga. Do I like like just my lips? Just naturally as they are. Usually they're covered in foundation. Is this a nice color? My teeth look yellow today. Not happy about that. I've got to do a self tape today. So that's why we're in drag. You might be able to tell, I mean, I don't really know if you can, because usually I've got the ring light on anyway, but it's like dead bright outside because it's the daytime and I'm sat inside getting in drag. It's really sunny as well, which is sad, but you know, you've got to do what you've got to do, haven't you? So my palette and lipstick has finally arrived from Trixie Cosmetics. Um, it's not their fault that it took forever to come. I mean, I was the one that was stupid enough to order a product that was coming all the way from America when I live in the UK, but I've got it and I'm really happy about it. I swear, like, my neighbours must, well, they must hate me for many reasons, mainly the singing, but, like, they always have, like, well, they don't have to, but they always end up picking up my parcels because, like, I don't know what I do, but... Because I do work from home as well. So you would think like, oh, you know, he'll be in for his parcels, but apparently I never am. And they always end up like having to bring them over for me. And I always feel really bad. They're like my own like personal parcel people. And I feel feel bad about it. I tried to make a little bit of a joke as well over it. And um, I don't know if she just didn't hear me, but she didn't laugh. So I hope I'm not irritating her. I mean, Maybe she'll watch this and she'll she'll know how like bad I feel about it. It got delivered next door because I was away like seeing some of my boyfriend's family. And then like when I came back, I was like, I couldn't, whenever I like was knocking, they weren't in and I was like, shit, they've moved away and I've waited all this time for this parcel, but they hadn't because it's here, woo. I've already opened it. It's not really an unboxing, but it is an unboxing for you. But look, look at how pretty the box is. I'm gonna keep this box and put things in it. But, oh, that's the eyeshadows all fucking smashed a bit then. Fantastic, great start to video. This is the innard, the innard. But there's a little postcard in there as well. I'm gonna read it to you. Thank you for your purchase, BB. You know what that means. I'm sure you'll see that when it comes to cosmetics, I'm no dumb blonde. These products are the real deal. Don't let the adorable packaging and wallet-friendly prices fool you. For drag queens and normals alike, Trixie Cosmetics is com committed is committed to providing makeup that will make everyone feel like a legend, icon, and a star. Well, luckily for her, I already do. We are also cruelty-free and donate a portion of our sales to the Bee Conservancy, Conservancy sorry, a non-profit organisation dedicated to protecting bees, safeguarding the environment, and securing food justice through education, research, habitat creation, and advocacy. Oh, that's real sweet. I knew they were cruelty free, but I didn't know that they also gave a portion of their sales to the Bee Conservancy. So that makes me feel good that like, it was quite a lot of money for me. I mean, to be fair, a lot of that money was on the postage. But like, that makes you feel good, doesn't it? I will definitely be putting this postcard up in my room. You can't stop me. I'm gonna do it. I ordered the Team Katia palette. Ooh, it's real shiny, I like that. Um, and also the Red Scare lipstick. I got the Team Katia palette, not only because like, I love Katia, um, and I'm just in such high support of everything that she does, apparently, um, but also because the colors are kind of more like my sort of drag. Um, I don't know what to use, really. You would have thought that I'd have come prepared, but I've not, do I ever? No. I think, I think I'm gonna use the, oh, I've just realized it's got like little cartoons of like her on the, that's not called the pearl, is it? What's that called? The horse. Ah, that's so cute, I like that. So we've got warm up, which is this red color. 
rigged, which is like this nice sort of, can you tell like it's quite shimmery sort of, I'd say that we're like kind of a very deep copper color. We've got laid out, which is like nice brown, chalked up, which on the video that I watched, like it doesn't really seem to do very much, but I think I'm gonna put it under my brows to kind of like make a bit of a highlight. Um, we've got Shaposhnikova, which is this cool, nice pink, which I'm definitely gonna be using at some point, let's be honest. Um, Underscored, which is this like silver flip-flop in the brown. Yashenko, I think, which is this blue, which again, we know I'm gonna be using that. Dismount, this blue that looks like a snooker cue chalk thing. Plank. I mean, I rarely ever use purples and I also hate to plank, so I'll, I'll still use it though. It's quite pretty actually, it's very shimmery. Um, amplitude, which is this like nice black. And then goat. I know what goat means because I watched the unveiling of this makeup palette. Greatest of all time it means, in case you didn't. But um, me and my friend both have like Apple watches and whenever we do workouts, we like send each other like sassy comments. So one of them is like G-O-A-T, the goat thing. And then, but then it's got a picture of a goat afterwards and she was like, what are you talking about? And I was like, greatest of all time. And I felt so like, I know about things that you wouldn't expect me to because I'm not a sporty person. How pretty she is. Just sparking in the light. Go on, Katia. Sexy bitch. I'm gonna do this real dark flip-flop brown laid out. And I think I'm gonna use this sort of, um, this rigged color that's like coppery. Maybe I'll use a little bit of warm up as well. We'll see how I feel. So first of all, I've got to find some brushes that are clean, which we know is not the easiest thing to do. I've actually come across one straight away. Have I? Oh no, that's got some sort of shimmer on it. I think that should be fine there. Let it be known that if I am like, not nice about these products, it could be that I'm just not using clean brushes. This looks like it's had brown on it before, so that should be fine. Actually, it looks like it is clean. What is it that's coming off of it though? I saw a thing the other day where um, Gigi Good was like talking about how apparently like sometimes bacteria can get in your eyes from your brushes and then it can paralyze you, so. That's concerning. I'm gonna do the flip flop and then I'm gonna buff it out into the laid out and then I'm gonna do like the crease. Or maybe I could do, I might do the warm up into flip flop into laid out. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay. That is more of a pink than I thought it was gonna be. Is this because, is this right? Um, what am I gonna do? What shall I use to double check? Maybe a clean brush would be in order, but. I don't have them. I just don't have any of those. Yes, yeah, so it wasn't the brush, it is definitely. I mean, it is a nice red, but I would. This looks like this kind of pink that I'm gonna imagine this is gonna be. Unless I've gone colorblind or something, I don't really know. But it's not like, it doesn't look the red. It does actually in the camera, but in person it's got, it's got quite a like raspberry sort of color to it. Whereas on there, it looks like a fire engine sort of red color. Bum, 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 bum. It is definitely pink, is that the like, I'm not, I don't think I'm colorblind. Right, Darius Dinesh. Then we're gonna go into this like very dark brown flip flop color. There's, oh, it's really um kicking up, is that one? Oh, she is a lot darker than I expected. So we'll just put a little bit on and then I'm gonna buff it across with the red and put a little bit more on. I was like, that's too much. And now I'm like, it's not enough. So now we're just going in with the brown. It's the laid out color is this one. I must say that I do regret putting on the flip flop because I think, do I though? Do I regret that? I just can't be sure. This brown, the laid out color. I don't, let's put it on my hand actually before I start making, making claims. Maybe this had some shimmer on the brush before because it looks a little bit, ah! <laughs> sorry, um, because I sit cross-legged and then I get like pins and needles and then I have to move around a lot and then I show you my hairy legs. Um, I think it, I had some shimmer on the brush, so it's gone a little bit shimmery on this side, but actually on my hand it is matte, so I was about to be like, oh, this is shimmery, but it's not. It's just me being a fucking pig. 
with my brushes. I don't know if it looks a bit like muddy in the lens, but in person it looks nice, like it does like have a nice gradient. I do think this colour actually makes my eyes look nice and green though. Pretty green eyes. So for the circle and such light. And then I'm gonna go in with the chalk it up colour just to like buff it out into the top. I don't actually know if this is still available to be fair. I don't think that they were like selling out super quick like some of the stuff does. <gasps> oh shit. What did I just I thought I did something to chalk it up, but I hadn't put it just laid out and now I've got a fucking I've got like the equivalent of Bosco's eyebrow on my fucking eyelid now, that's good. This chalk it up does like help you out quite a lot though. I feel like I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of that one. I am also just kind of literally like tapping it into the products because um I want this to last me because like as I say like it's not often that I buy like nicer makeup for myself. Um and like it like not a lot of it is coming out either, so that's kind of indicating to me that this is gonna last quite well. And then I'm just gonna do like my cut crease thing. You've all seen people do this before. You might have even seen me do this before. Yep, I've definitely got loads, loads of concealer in my eyelash. That's always ideal, isn't it? Shit. For fuck's sake, Tracy. Now I'm gonna go onto the part that I've just cut with the rigged, I think. Do I want to use rigged or do I want to use gut? I think I'm gonna use GOAT. Again, on the hunt for a clean brush. The brush was purple and the brush is actually like a creamy color and I'm like, oh, is that clean? Then shocked that I had purple on. Oh, she's pretty. Oh, she's very pretty. Can you hear that music outside? My street is like the Fast and the Fucking Furious, like just constant like whizzing cars. Lots of very loud music. But then I am in here screaming my tits off, so I can't really complain too much, do you know what I mean? Oh yeah, I'm gonna put a bit of the gold light under the eye as well. Ooh, who's she? You know like when you just feel very sexy? Oh, I really like that. I've definitely got it in my eyeball. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a little angled brush um, and I'm gonna go into the flip flop again and like bring that up into the where I'm gonna do the wing. And just so it's quite nice and dark. Hello. You know that Destiny said it, you gotta get up and get it, get mad independent and don't you ever forget it. You got some dirt on your shoulder, let me brush it off for you. If you're feeling me, put your thighs high. That's my girl. Oh, she's beautiful. I'm a very big fan of this palette, Trixie Mattel. I'm gonna put on some mascara and then some lashes and then I'll come back and I will do the lipstick. That old day, donkey, that old day. Do you ever just like sit and put the mascara on so your false eyelashes as if you've got like these giant natural lashes? I do because my lashes are dirty. Cool, so I'm back. I was thinking I might like use some of this for my um for my blush today. So I'm gonna use the Shaposhnikova on my cheeks for the br blush, sorry, not the brush, for the blush. I love like a hot pink blush. I think it's so like, I just think it's real pretty. Got the state of my nose contour today. Who did that for me? Me, that's who did that for me. I'm just gonna use a red lip liner um, that I already have. Where is it? Where is it, Candy? I could not tell you what color it is because they all had like stickers on and they've all fallen off. Um, but this is just one of the Give Face, um, like, pencils. Oh, she fucking broke. So this is the Red Scare. I've already gone through it with you. Um, I mean, it's real cute packaging, isn't it? So even if it is shit, like, that'll still look cute just sitting out on the side. I'm not usually a lipstick person. I'm usually, like, a, a liquid lip kind of gal, so this could be quite difficult for me. Oh. I'm always too scared to like go too like close to the edge with lipsticks because I just find them a lot harder to handle. Um, but yeah, I like that, that's a winner. Lovely, right, so I'm gonna go and put on my hair piece and my fringe and 
B.R.B. See you soon. I don't know if I like this fringe. I'm getting weird sort of like Lady Di vibes off myself. Don't prefer it like that. Not one tiny bit of hair that's like just poking me in the fucking eye. Come on, you bastard, get out. No, nope, just all there. <laughs> I got you up. Fucking kind. Lovely jubbly. So, that is my um, sort of unboxing, I guess, of the Trixie and Katia Team Trixie Team Katia palette. Yeah, I actually really liked it. Um, I don't know why I'm like, yeah, I actually really liked it. I don't, you're always like worried, aren't you, when something's like quite expensive and you can't try it out first, that like it's gonna turn out to be shit, but it didn't. So that's always good news. Would definitely recommend like, I don't know, if you're buying it in the UK, like it is quite expensive. Um, and I mean, I do think like it is a very good product. So, you know, I would recommend getting it. But I also understand, like, because it was, like, a stretch for me to get it as well. Um, so, yeah, I do think if you can get it and you can afford it, like, it is a lovely product to have. Um, and in America as well, like, the postage won't be as much as it was to the UK. So if you are in America, then defo do, like, sort of try and get it. Um, the lipstick also was really, like, I'm a huge fan of it. It doesn't, you can't really kind of get a grasp of how like nice it looks in the lens. Um, like I just looked at myself in the mirror like whilst I was putting the pony in and stuff and I was like, this is really, really lovely. Um, so yeah, I mean, I would defer if like, cause this is like obviously the more expensive thing. If you can get one of these, then like it is really lovely. It's also not like, you know, sometimes when you put them on and they're a bit dry, like it doesn't feel dry. Um, obviously that's more of a like wearability thing. So like it could potentially get more dried out as the day goes on. This ponytail's new and it smells like the hair shop. You know, like that like nice conditioner sort of smell. I'm really excited about it. Can't wait to ruin this one. That's my little unboxing of the Team Katia palette and red scare lipstick. Yeah, definitely get it if you can. But yeah, I really liked it. I don't even know if it's still available. So I could be like, oh yeah, get it. And then you're gonna go to the website and it's not there. So I don't know what to tell you about that. Um, maybe just like try and bully Trixie into making some more. But don't actually bully her, please. Cause that's not very kind, is it? As always, if you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, um, share with your friends, comment, all of those things. Um, my Instagram and TikTok will be on at the end. It is Domino Official as always. Um, but yeah, until next time, thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon. Bye. I'll tell you what. Oh, she's a stunner.